People with hemophilia A lack factor VIII and require prophylactic or episodic intravenous infusions of factor VIII, typically two or more times per week, to prevent bleeding complications. About one-third develop antibodies or inhibitors against factor VIII, and despite regular factor VIII infusions, bleeding complications can occur. The HAVEN-3 trial was a phase three multicenter study to evaluate a novel prophylactic treatment, subcutaneous emicizumab, a monoclonal antibody that bridges activated factor IX and factor X to replace the function of missing factor VIII. The trial included 152 people who were 12 or older with hemophilia A without factor VIII inhibitors. Patients previously using episodic factor VIII were randomized to receive emicizumab maintenance once a week, emicizumab maintenance once every two weeks, or placebo. Patients previously using prophylactic factor VIII were switched to weekly emicizumab maintenance. Treatment continued for up to 50 weeks. For patients previously using episodic factor VIII, the annualized bleeding rate was 38.2 with placebo, as compared with 1.5 with the weekly emicizumab dose and 1.3 with the every two weeks emicizumab dose, a reduction of more than 96% with both emicizumab doses. For patients previously using prophylactic factor VIII, the annualized bleeding rate was reduced from 4.8 with factor VIII to 1.5 with emicizumab maintenance, a 68% reduction. Over half of patients on emicizumab had no bleeding episodes. The most frequent adverse event was a low-grade injection site reaction. There were no thrombotic events, antidrug antibodies, or factor VIII inhibitors. The authors conclude that for patients with hemophilia A without inhibitors, subcutaneous emicizumab prophylaxis once weekly or every two weeks significantly reduced the bleeding rate, and weekly emicizumab was associated with significantly lower bleeding rates than factor VIII prophylaxis. Full trial results are available at NEJM.org.